And now we're ready to go. Okay, okay. Oh, oh my gosh, and then it hit the can. Get over here, okay. I have no intro sequence. Hopefully Amy introduces this video with an intro sequence because I can't hit that to, I don't know what I'm doing. Hey guys, welcome to GT Not Live, where I'm solo on the couch today because Stephanie is taking a much deserved and much needed mental, mental stress-free couple days. Uh, but I still gotta make videos for you guys because I don't wanna leave you all hanging and there's a lot for us to do. We got meme reviews to cover. We got, I still wanna defeat Alpha Rad in his insane series of levels because I just saw on Twitter that Alpha Rad 2, Super Alpha Rad World 2 is out. And I'm really actually excited to play that one because I've been enjoying those levels. And also, the topic of today's video, maybe Stephanie's lucky that she's missing out on this one. Baldi's Basics is back. You remember that game? Yeah, that still exists. Uh, so Baldi's Basics, uh, that delightful educational game from the 90s, or at least the parody of it, it's back with apparently more gameplay, more levels, and just a fuller fleshed out game. So... That's what we're playing today. We all know how much I loved playing it the first time. It was a lot, and by a lot I mean not at all. So, yeah, let's let's join in this little adventure together, shall we? Baldi's Basics Plus, just you, me, editor Amy, viewing us from her editing Haven on High, hopefully introducing all the embarrassing clips of me. And yes, that is, oh, I, my head, I should have moved it this way the entire time. Yes, that is me, picture in picture with myself. I understand that it's there. I recognize that it's there. I don't know how to get rid of it. I don't have time to figure out how to get rid of it because time is really tight with Stephanie off uh, and me doing all of this stuff solo right now. So, I don't know. It's just me talking with my good friend, Matt Pat, who just mirrors my every image. Is this Matt Pat? Why, yes, yes it is. Is this Matt Pat? Yeah. Uh, so anyway, for the next three videos or however many of these GT Not Lives I'm able to film over the next couple days, that will probably remain a persistent feature. That is the quality level that you're getting right. Just janktacular. GT Live, it's janktacular. Baldi's Basics, let's hop into this. You know what we're getting ourselves into. Or maybe you don't, I don't. This is a brand new game, right? This is Baldi's Basics. Plus, uh, okay, so I hit ME4, right? Yes! Look who's figuring this stuff out. I hit, I figured out the one button that was able to transition it. All right, Baldi's Basics Plus. Baldi's Basics Plus cost 10 bucks. I'm excited to see what is, I'm excited to see what this whole thing is about, all right? Morning, Baldi's Basics Plus added level is a mild horror game, mild. Not not quite not quite spicy, just mild. It's not educational software. Be aware, it is not educational. Horror elements are relatively light at this stage of the game's development. There are still a few jump scares and other elements that might frighten some players. Okay, there we go. Oh, hi. Welcome to my super schoolhouse. So excited to that come this come on is... in. Just click on your name, or if you haven't been here before, just type it in, and then click on it. It's that easy. Uh-huh. So is this, a, this, is his, uh, this is his arm, right? I love the overlapping layer. Just, oh, God. Oh, good selfie there, Baldy. Your mouth is horrific. What, what happened, buddy? <laughs> I understand that mapping words to mouths is incredibly difficult. Very time-consuming, but I... I, I Nailed it, 10 out of 10. It's, it's brilliant. This is, this is exactly what I expected out of this game. What, what else would I want out of Baldi's Basics? Welcome. Since you're new, be sure to check out the controls. Thank you, I, I would love to. Baldi's Basics Plus. Oh, this is version 0.1.1. Great, okay. Uh, Baldi's Basics Plus is early access. Got a lot of work to do. 
improve menus. How can you get better? You can't improve these menus. You cannot improve them. Dynamic, dynamic music, horror elements. <laughs> yeah, for a game that got popular off of its like mild horror, like horror elements, ah, we'll just fit those in later. Edutainment elements. Oh, if Baldi's Basics counts as edutainment, then I need to stop calling our channels edutainment channels. In-game shop for YouTube premium subscribers? YouTube YTP? Great. For yips. Uh, more content like levels, challenges, characters. Expect bugs if you encounter a bug. The question, though, is what is the difference between actual gameplay features and bugs? Because you hear that meme thrown around a lot. But when it comes to Baldi's basics, I feel like the two are intrinsically linked, right? Resolution, mouse sensitivity, great, 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 great. Subtitles, yes, give me that. Uh, perfect. Well, check out the controls. I did look for the controls. They, there was nowhere for me to find the controls. Oh, geez, there's all sorts of modes now. Hide and seek, explorer mode, endless, okay. Hide and seek with Baldi. Can you beat all the levels without losing? Explore Baldi's super schoolhouse. To your heart's content, you could explore any level you've reached. Okay, so I gotta play hide and seek. Is that main mode, I guess? Endless mode. Collect as many notebooks as you can before Baldi tags you. He speeds up, but notebooks slow him down. Huh. Try your hand at one of Baldi's crazy challenges. Go on a field trip whenever you want and try to set the best score possible. So I'm good. Uh, hide and seek is the main mode, I guess? <laughs> Tubes, yes. <laughs> Obligatory tubes. Elevate. Let's elevate this, guys. F floor one. Let's elevate. Oh, hi. Let's play hide and seek. Yeah, let's. Oh, the elevator goes. Okay, great. So we're done elevating. So is this just baldy? Like, oh. Wait! Oh! So that just activated immediately then. That was... School faculty only. Okay, so that's... Huh. So I'm assuming this is the same thing, right? Just the, the usual, like, collect all the stuff. <laughs> I'm kind of regretting my decision to turn on closed captions, I gotta admit. Alright. Come on, balds. Come on, balds. He's gonna get me. Woo! Slap! So, okay, that indicates every time... Oh, of course the principal gets me. 15 seconds. All right. Detention for you. Great. Wow. When will you I know you guys always request that I put on the captions, but holy jeez, I might need to not do this for this game. Because <laughs> there is... A lot of captions happening right now. It is pretty overwhelming. So can he find me if I'm in a locker? There's the principal. So we can go outside now. Students, please refrain from using the phone while Professor Baldi's in the building. It causes him to forget what he was doing and prevents him from hearing. Okay. Please remember to recycle your food. I will Looks say... Like it's time. Oh my god, there's so many closed captions everywhere. Oh my god, there's so many closed captions. I feel like... I feel like somewhere around here, I can... Uh, I feel like the, the closed captions are indicating to me where... You can't hide from me, all right. So there's a notebook. Um, that these closed captions are somehow teaching me, Apple of Day 6 Lives, uh, where Baldi and all the other characters are, but I don't know for sure. What's the, what's the ringing? Baldi's fog machine? What? Oh, curse Baldi's fog machine. You must, you must work in the theater department, little known fact. Because, ha, uh, the theater department fog machines are always failing. Can't hide from me. Oh yeah, that's right. In order to... It's very peaceful when Baldi's, uh, fog machine is working. Can he see me in here? Uh, sweep, sweep, sweep. 
Okay, it's good to know that it doesn't open. Yeah, sweep, sweep, sweep. So you're... Okay, well, clearly hiding in the locker does not help. It just causes him to freak out in front of you. Uh, it doesn't replace your stamina. So really, the locker seems relatively meaningless. Let's be honest here. Just gonna... Buzz. Oh, we lost there, so that was that was great. Thank you. Good, good, good first attempt. Let's play hide and seek. Great. Let's do that. So if I open this, are you just gonna automatically start attacking? So is he giving me just some leeway time? Okay, so, it w so it's not tied to me picking up the first notebook. It's literally just me starting the game and after a certain point, he's just gonna start chasing me. Okay, so it really is kind of like hide and seek. You know, you just hide and then he kind of seeks you, but you're also collecting notebooks. So great. I miss, I miss the education. I miss learning basic arithmetic from this game. I feel kind of uh, gypped out of this. I gotta admit, you know, I liked testing my knowledge of numbers. <laughs> Basic one plus one, all that. Uh, there's there's one. I'm a chima gum. What's this thing? I forget what this is. Oh, that's just a good set tape, great. So we only need one more. Not too shabby. School faculty lounge we should avoid because there's really no reason for us to go in there. I don't think we really need any items, and the last thing I want is the principal to get me. Ooh, hello, emergency gate. That Oh, damn it. No, stop sweep. No, bad sweep. Bad touch, sweeper. Sweeper, no sweeping. I don't know what time does. Very intrigued by that. Can I? One. E. Wait, where's he at? Oh, God. No, don't no we don't gotta sweep sweep sweep. Oh sweep 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 Time. What do you think time's doing? Okay, here's this. So now what? Do I get back to the elevator? Is that what I gotta do? Oh no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What is this? I have no idea what is going on with this This game! I forgot. I forgot how insane this game was. I forgot. Probably, probably willfully forgot. 15 seconds. Wh where was I? You. You no! Time. What's the time do? Ah, poop, poop, go, go! Go! And then the fog machine is out here! So outside, it seems like you can run as much as you want. Uh, it seems unlimited. My stamina doesn't decrease outside, so that's good to know. Um, yeah, no clue. There's there's a lot going on here. <laughs> Great. Alarm clock ring. Is that the thing that I set and it kind of attracted him away from me? Learning the ins and outs of these items, I feel like, is, is going to be the, the ticket to success here. Time. What? What? What is this game? Oh my God. I forgot. I had forgotten. I had forgotten. I was so blissfully unaware of what this game was really. Again, like, it's been so long, and it was like, oh, that was just an unpleasant blip in my little gaming history. We tried it, we played it, it was great, it was fun, it was trendy at the time, but back, we're back in it, and, and like, somehow, it's managed to become even more glitchtacular. Somehow, it's managed to find new depths. Bottom and, doop! Baldy. Baldy's basics. Oh, hey. Ooh. Seems like the school got a little upgrade, huh? Okay, well, since you're gonna chase me, and we 
know that you're gonna chase me. Okay, great, there's one. Oh, and you, okay, so items carry over. There's a second elevator. That's interesting. Second elevator. Or maybe that's just the escape elevator for this level. I don't know. So that indicated that he knows where I'm at. I should save items. Or, so really what this tells me is that you need to collect. Let's go camping. What? What? Time. Logs. What? What is this? I don't know. I don't understand. This game is confusing. Like just... Is my fire going out? Why am I going so much slower? Go! Okay, my fire is going out. I see that. I see that's a thing. What? Okay, I gotta keep my fire. I get it. Okay. Keep my fire fire burning. The bully stole my sticks, which is really a bummer. Kind of sucks. Kind of mad about that. Okay, so this is... So I definitely blew it uh, the first time by uh, losing all my sticks to the bully. So we got a last... Oh, God, there's so much. I'm so sorry that this is all over the place. This is just a wild little adventure together. So this one seems... Like, you need to last for the entire, whatever, 120 seconds in the woods with Baldi um, before your fire goes out. We're going to go one more. So this is really about just route planning more than anything else and conservation of whatever the nearest logs are. Wow! It's just racking up whatever your score is. All right. Strange. Wow, Baldi. This is, this is quality gameplay in 2020, friends. This is it. Okay. Ooh, we're really far away. Uh-oh. What is that? What is that? What's the wind blowing? What is the wind blowing? Get out of here. Get out of here. No. Leave my fire alone, wind. You're the worst, Mother Nature. Shoot. There. Did that do something for me? Is this... Is this did I survive? Am I... Did I scare him away? I have so many questions and none of them are being answered. Why? And it's not like the good questions either of like, lore. I want lore questions. Uh, so a while ago, people asked, you know, why, uh, whether we would ever do Baldi's basics as, as a lore episode or, or kind of like a theory about Baldi's basics. The thing is, I, it, maybe in this new game there is? I've just never gotten the sense that there is like an actual lore to this, whether or not that's accurate, but it seemed like there should have been with all the kind of random objects that were being dropped in that first game and things like that, but I never got the sense that there was some larger story, um, or at least one that was actually going to be coherent. Fire's really warm. You've earned these prizes. I got a star. What's that mean? Thank you. And now we're back here, and we just can... What is that? Is it a grappling hook? Did I get a... Oh, it is a grappling hook. To do what? What can I do with a grappling hook? I'd like to climb onto... Like, what, the building? Wait, 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 is this... This feels grappling hook. Oh, whoa! Oh, it just kind of pulls you forward faster. Huh. All right, so the, the, the takeaways that I'm learning here are one, grab basically all the items in phase one, the first level, because that's where it's really easy. That's where the items carry over, so you're able to keep things a little bit better. Um, so that's good to know. The... Is this the wind again? What's the wind doing in the school now? Okay. Hello. 
<laughs> what? What was that thing? Also, you can tell he's a later addition because the an the animation of him is actually a lot better. <laughs> he was actually like legitimately pretty pretty decently animated. <laughs> I'm so confused. This is a game that is so confusing. And, and it's just so much. This is just gonna break me. It's gonna slowly break me. Uh, oh, hey, here we go. Here's this guy again. What? This is amazing. Great. Is, oh, he's got a gumball? Oh, wait, the math machine. Design not yet final. Six minus three. 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 There's a three. 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 Wow. Great. Okay, so that's how you get another notebook and Looks also like another track. No, sweeper. Sweeper, no sweeping. Okay. Okay, so Baldi's getting a little bit faster. He seems to ramp up a lot slower in this one, though, which is good to know. What's this thing? Dirty chalk eraser. Oh, poop. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh jeez. Oh, this is terrible. Is Baldi immune to the wind? I guess he is. Ooh, there's a classroom. At this point, I have no idea what these map layouts are, so I just gotta kind of like, oh darn it, another one of these. It's two, 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 two. Wow. Oh no. Ah, poops. Shoot, okay. Minus 50. So that was a good first run of, of level two, I guess. <laughs> Just a random sigh. Just a random sigh. That's how I feel playing this game. If that makes you feel better, sound effects. Just a sigh. Baldi's basics, le sigh. Okay, so Baldi's gonna start chasing me. Such a random locker placement. Like, oh, these are the lockers you can hide in. Yeah, yeah, the two right next to each other. Is that is that the thing? Is that what's gonna make the difference here in my survival in this game? Uh, let's see. There was this was the bus. I don't need the bus right now. This is detention room. There was a lot of nothing down these hallways. A lot of nothing. Uh, sweep, sweep, sweep. Except, ooh, maybe I should grab this one because I missed this the first time. Did I? Maybe, maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm just imagining. The notebooks replenish your stamina. That's actually a big plus. That's really nice. So that's a dead end because of course it is. <laughs> Baldi. Baldi's basics. The in, in this era of the PlayStation 5 announcement and photorealistic graphics, this is the game that 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 the public demanded. Right here. Someone someone give me a PS5 port of this one, huh? Nine. Go. Nine, 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 nine. Boop. Wow. Yes. So good. I've got so many scissors. I've got safety scissors up the wazoo, Baldi. You won't know what safety do. Ooh, there's ooh, shoot, there's another one. I should not have gone in this room. This was stupid of me. Wow. Yep, this was stupid of me. This is that poor form. Poor form. Okay, well, let's lure him in. Let's dance around, do a little dance. Do a little dance around Baldi. Do a little dance, do a little dance. Do a little dance, do a little dance. Okay, good. Get out of here. Okay, all right, here we go. This is go time now. This is this is serious, serious time. Oh, shoot, this is the beginning of the level. Okay. Hmm, 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 hmm. No bueno. Shoot. Oh, this game. Can I just leave with four notebooks? Can I just say that my learning is complete? That I'm satisfied with the amount of learning that I've had today? This is it, we're good. So, so it's Baldi with more randomized levels, more characters, more gameplay modes. Um, oh, he is right behind me, isn't he? I don't know if, if these other modes will like yield anything, am I just, Mystery room has appeared. Dodo, sweep, sweep, sweep. A mystery room has appeared. Find it before it disappears. I want a mystery room. 
Show me that mystery room. Nothing down there. Oh, that's what I want to know. I want to know the mystery room. And again, it'll probably be just horrendously disappointing. But I'm very curious about a mystery room. Oh, five. oh no! No! Shoot. Sweep me! Sweep me! Sweep me off my feet, broom! Broom! Oh, that was my chance. That was my chance. Oh, sweep! So is it no? I, I'm assuming it's notebook based rather than time based because I've been. Hey, you! Watch this. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? What's what's wrong with you? I don't, I don't know what your deal is. Also, dirty chalk eraser. Not clear what this is gonna do for me either. Did literally nothing. Good. Gl glad that the dirty chalk eraser did literally nothing in Baldi's face. Fantastic. We're we're. Great. Thank you for that. You're good. Let's keep playing. I shouldn't get this one first. This is... So, the one thing I think, as people played more and more of Baldi's Basics, what, two years ago when this was... When this was the thing? Um, 15 seconds. Detention for you. I think the thing that everyone kind of learned about it was all of it is tied to mapping your route through the school building so that way you have the most efficient route between the notebooks possible. And... The, the challenge, I guess, of this one is if, if it is truly randomized, now all of a sudden, the, the positive is that it means that those sorts of strategies kind of go away. The negative, though, is it also means that you're going to be put into situations that, that could almost potentially be unwinnable um, if the randomization wasn't done kind of well enough. So I wonder, I wonder what precautions are kind of put in place around that sort of stuff. Uh, here, I'm gonna, oh, that's teacher's lounge. Twenty seconds. I wasn't, oh, I wasn't running in the hall! I have gum literally smashed to my, oh, just, just do it. Just, just do your, just do your worst, Baldy. Nope. That's fine. It's fine. Oh, you get three times? Oh, no, and then you're starting at the beginning again. No. Notebooks. Let's play hide and seek. So three times and then it reset. Okay, so I don't have my I don't have my stuff anymore. But we're at five notebooks, which is different because the first time was four. So is the number of notebooks you need on any given mission also randomized? That's interesting. And I know I'm saying the the I word. I know I'm saying it a bunch. I'm sorry. Forgive me, I don't have Stephanie to kind of talk me down from the from the edge. Maybe I'm just particularly fascinated with the mechanics of things. Bardy? Bardy. So the cafeteria still exists, that's good to know. Three. So is this level one or level two? The wood paneling would seem to suggest it's level. Hey, you! Watch this! No, leave me alone! Nobody wants me! Leave me alone! Okay, here we go. Fresh soda. Great, we'll grab one of those. I, I like the fact that they're making it clear what kind of the listening mechanic is, right? Because I think one of the big question marks of previous games was what is and isn't Baldi able to hear. And so now seeing like an icon activate every time he quote unquote hears something, I think that's actually pretty good to know. Let's just know this so again. This, I am, I'm very perturbed about this one. Honestly, gotta, gotta admit, this is, this is making me upset right here. This is making me really okay, thanks. That is literally the worst possible thing that could happen. Okay, here's number five. Right. Fifteen seconds. Great, I don't... Detention for you. What will you learn? Is that a random room? Baldi, no, Baldi's. So the, the alarm bell is a random event happening in the world, whether it's a random room or a random fog machine activating. That's Baldi. So now, we search for 
the elevator? We're approaching the wind blowing. All right, well, we'll just we'll just blow right along with it, won't we? I do like the wind when it works to my advantage. So you know, kind of inconsistent there. But the wind is nice. He, oh, he was it? So good, I love this game, so good. Love it. I just oh, hi. Thanks. Let's play hide and seek. Okay, let's play hide and seek. Okay, I'm gonna start here. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay, so he started. Here's the principal. Oh, Kind of reminds me of uh, my middle school's principal, honestly. He was kind of like that. He always thought he was the cool dude. And so he would, he was like, I'm principal. He, he, th he thought he was like God's gift to both teaching and to the ladies. Uh, you could tell in the way that he kind of like talked to everyone. It's like, oh, this guy thinks, thinks he's kind of all that. Can I avoid this? Nope, certainly not. Certainly not able to avoid that. So this is really the kiss of death right here. This this gum, because you're just done. That is brutal. Okay. But uh, but yeah, the the, the principal definitely reminds me of him because he also like dressed kind of casually because he's like I'm cool. I'm the principal. No, no one's gonna judge me. Um. Gosh, this guy is literally the worst character. Like, there's a lot of wacky characters in this game, but oh my gosh, gum, gum boy, gumball boy, the boy who cried gum, hate him. Literally the worst, worst creation. No, no! I'm so happy about this. Okay. But, uh, did he come this way? Did Baldi follow me back this way or did he? His slaps seem to be getting closer. I will say that is one, uh, for as overwhelming as these subtitles are, especially at the beginning here, uh, I do like the fact that they tell you how close you are to certain events happening in the world around you. Um, where like, at least when it came to the wind, you can see yourself getting closer to the wind or like the whistling getting smaller as you're kind of moving in the same direction but he's moving faster than you. I do appreciate that. Oh, there's the elevator. I just need one more. Just one more! And I think this is it. This should be it, right? Oh no. Oh boop. No! Bully! Get out of here, bully! Bully, bully! Leave me alone. So close. This is it. The wood paneling on this the school is just really great. It's really great. Fantastic. And the and the and the design, the overall design of this building, just top notch. Let's be honest. It's it's really fantastic. Nope, nothing there. Delightful. No, no, no! Get a, get a consistent art style! Gumball jerk! Yeah, I know that was a real sick burn on my part. Sickest of burns, he had no idea what hit him. My words really hurt him, it cut deep. Okay. One, two. I don't know what the timer does. I'm assuming it distracts Baldi at a certain point. One cannot be too sure. But that's what I'm gonna go with. Boop. Boop. There's Baldi. So yeah, uh, going back to the randomization stuff, I do wonder a little bit about that because you hear that a lot in the debates of like, oh, are, should developers be randomizing their game for more replay value or is a better constructed and more precisely constructed world 
and level design ultimately going to be a better result. And I feel like for a resource management game kind of like this, where you are kind of managing your resources of stamina and like items, but absolutely like stamina is your kind of major factor of whether you win or lose a particular round. I think that randomization might actually lead to some pretty difficult scenarios unless there are very precise rules put in place by the developer. Don't let the Kronos spot, spot it's weird. Um, wait, what? Is he spitting at me? Am I going to get hit by gum right now? In, yeah, unless there are specific rules in place of like no notebooks can appear X distance from each other. Otherwise, it's going to be too far. Or maybe you elongate that a little bit as you kind of like develop more additional rules to the game. Not not sure. But uh, but I see this as the type of game where that sort of thing would be kind of challenging or something you really have to precisely manage. So that was F1. So apparently that was just back to level one again because that's how good I am at this game. BB plus. Double B plus. Floor two. Oh. Okay, so it is. Good is a bit of an overstatement of my abilities, I feel like. Uh, in fact, good is just a, a gross overstatement of what I'm actually in this game, which is anti-good. I would dare say bad. One might, one might suggest that I'm bad at this game. Uh, you know. Okay, there's Bubble Boy. Oh, okay, here we're back to these again, okay. Pop, 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 pop. Getting in and out of the rooms, kind of the single most important thing. Okay. What's the problem? Is he gonna spit at me? Spit at me. Yes, good. I'm glad that missed. Okay. What's my math problem? Zero, zero. Yes, I'm so rich. Got two quarters. I've got an alarm clock. Got two notebooks. My education is flying right now. Whoops. Accidentally right click. That's fine. We'll learn what it does. We'll, we'll learn together what the alarm clock is going to do for us. At some point. If it ever goes off. It might not go off. Who knows? Very unclear. Okay. Got another math problem. Three, 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 there's three. Woo, three. This is smart, I like this. That's a really, that's a really fun mechanic. I like that a lot. Okay, that looks like it is just kind of random blue doors down there, but not any good ones. It looks like the broom closet, honestly. Oh, there's a library now. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is just a death trap. Oh my gosh. There's no way. Oh jeez. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, this is this is this is anti bueno. Oh no. What's this say? Janitors must wear boots when sweeping. Okay, good to know. Glad glad to hear it. Glad to hear that cleanliness is a top priority in this school. See, Baldi's basics, doing, doing, doing a good service by coming out at a time when, you know, no one else is really dealing with school or anything, so. Oh, geez. I'm, what? Watch out for whirlpools? What? What is this? No! There's a... You got bigger fish to fry principle than me running in the hallways. There's literally, oh my gosh, there's literally a whirlpool in this room. Get out of here. No! No! Stop it. Get sucked into a whirlpool, Baldy. Oh. Oh, this game, okay. I think I have one life left. Maybe it's three per. There's the bus. I wonder what happens if you get three stars. Anything? Is it anything, Baldy? I'm, I'm inclined to say no. Uh, 
something tells me that my the time I'm gonna put into this game will not be super rewarded on the other end. That is just a suspicion that I have. I could be wrong. This is principal, okay. Okay, there's a book room. Stay out of the library. I think we all learned that one. Okay, whistling's coming, so let's avoid him. Stay out of the library. This one is one, 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 one. Yes, go. Wow. Yeah, wow. Molly May thing, wow. Great. Okay. So we're three. Three notebooks. We got this. I feel good. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident. My balloon arithmetic is second to none. Champ when it comes to doing doing basic math mathematics. Okay, wait. For, I'm just gonna wait for this to pass. There we go. You better not be able to spit out a second one in short order, cause that would that would blow and not blow bubbles. Okay, here we go. What's this? One minus one is zero. 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 Go. 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 Thank you. Thanks, Baldy. I'm glad I impressed you with my basic subtraction. It's one of my superpowers. No. Oh, come on! Boo! Boo! Uh, boo! It flew through the door? Get a- No! Where is he at? Where's Baldy? Where's Baldy? Okay. Five. Oh, he's getting close. I don't... There, yeah, I was gonna say he's getting real close. Okay, here we go. Shoot, there's the elevator! Oh, if only! Oh, there's no way. Oh, he's getting close. I don't want to look around. It's going to slow me down. Ooh, is this the door? Oh, no! He caught up to me. Shit, I'm so close. I'm so close! Ooh, okay, last time. I think this is my last level. Or my last life. What are all these points? I like that this game pretends that points matter. This is like the whose line is it anyway. This is like the anti whose line is it anyway. Whose line is it anyway? Points don't matter. Baldi's basics. Points don't matter. But we are gonna pretend like we do. <laughs> they don't matter, but we're gonna make it seem like they might. This is principal's office, okay, great. Two, great, okay, keep going. Okay, this one is nine, 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 nine. Nope, 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 nope. There, oh, that's a, that's actually a faster way to do that. I kind of like that. Just grab a bunch of the balloons and then burn through them uh, so that we can get to your your target faster, actually. That's pretty great. So the alarm clock, what is the alarm clock doing? That is a good question. Hmm. It's a catchy tune, principal. Whistling Dixie over there, okay. Here, Baldy. I'm gonna grab three. One minus one is zero, zero. Zero, great. No, I had, oh God. Stop, get out of the way, three. No, get out of the, th get out of the way, three. Oh, damn it. I blame three. I blame three. I don't know what this clock is gonna do, but I'm gonna pretend like it's gonna be effective in some way. Oh, he got faster because- No! That's it. He got faster because- Oh! Okay. So the balloon grab strategy, not the best. I thought it- I thought it might have helped. I was wrong. I was wrong about a lot of things. Made a lot of bad decisions in my life, honestly. First and foremost of those playing Baldi's Basics Plus. Am I gonna play more? Probably. Why? I don't really know, to be honest. Part of me doesn't want to let this game beat me. It's what it is. TriCaster, sure. Double double windows for days. Totally recognize the fact that I'm an utter failure in running the TriCaster, but that's also because I haven't had a chance to, to learn it, whatever. This game, though. A game that looks and plays like this? No, it will not beat me. Or at least not on level two. Maybe on... Level three, it most certainly will. I'm having an existential crisis right now because I'm having one of those debates in my head about like, is this a game that I really want to keep playing? Is this a game that I want to dedicate the time to get good at?
I guess find out next time. In the meantime, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, it's going to be more of me doing my thing on the couch solo for a while. So hopefully you enjoy that. Me with mirror me up in the upper right-hand corner. Picture in picture me. We'll call him Pip Pat. Matt Pip. Because picture in picture is short and Pip. So it'll be Matt Pip up in the corner. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I will probably do at least one more of these videos just because... Getting past one level in a campfire game is not satisfying to me, so we'll see how it goes. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next video. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to unceremoniously get off the couch and awkwardly turn off the TriCaster. So in the meantime, remember, that's not a video. That was a video. It wasn't a theory. It wasn't live. But it was a video on demand for you. Hopefully you enjoyed it. It was a hot mess. Just a hot mess. You know what? What am I, what am I kidding at this point? This live stream, me running this all by myself, is basically the Baldi's basics of gaming videos on YouTube. Who else? Who else doesn't use OBS? Who else has a picture in picture of themselves without actually understanding how to get rid of it? Who else has to get off the couch? Like, everyone else has, like, cameras right at their face, Matthew. What are you thinking?